This is why you shouldn't compare yourself to models. I could stay like this forever following you. This is not realistic. You think your skin's not good enough to matter? Okay. Still don't believe me? Watch this. At the end of the day, we're all just humans. This is from a runway show, and the designer actually had all the models show off their acts. I will prove every single one of your insecurities one by one. Let me guess. You do, but you don't know how to get started. Well, I do. The first step is to get some visuals. Uh, first of all, you should be wearing a little pair of makeup. Mm, much better. Remove the jewelry. Uh huh. And you'll need to take your hair down, but here's a hair cut because you're going to put your hair And you need a black pink coffee box. And lastly, you'll need some black people heels. Make sure you screenshot this. So submit away. Good luck and congratulations. This is why you shouldn't compare yourself to models. I could stay like this forever following you. This is not realistic. Tell me you're a model without telling me you're a model. I own probably upwards of 70 pairs of heels. I don't have to worry about finding the right foundation color because my photo is below the foundation. The Victoria's Secret Angels are a lot more down to earth than you think they are. They're really nice people. Half of my closet is the color black. I can get free food all around the world just by posting on Instagram. I can start a whole fashion trend just by being photographed in it. There are clothes in my closet right now that were gifts from designers from fashion. I can probably tell you what's going to be in next season. But that's a secret, since I saw the collection before it came out. I know without a doubt that I can make it to 10 different meetings in one day. I'm friends with some of the most beautiful women in the world. I own makeup that hasn't come out yet, because they gave it to me.
be able to do what I do. our facial muscles to make expressions. This is my face totally relaxed. Pose my face, I lift my brows up, but not too much. Just lift your brows a little bit so your eyes look lifted. One time at a photo shoot, I actually saw a model do this with her lip to create a little more volume in her upper lip. Just make sure you don't do it too much or else you're gonna look like a duck. <laughs> you can inhale to make your nose appear slimmer, but don't overdo it. Just subtle like this. A trick to make your neck appear slimmer, you can bring your chin forward towards the camera like this. It feels super awkward when you're doing it. I mean, look what I look like from the side. My chin is completely forward. But from the front, you would never know. If you're posing from the side, move your jaw towards the camera to create a more sharp and defined jawline like this. Again, it's gonna feel really awkward. Look what I look like from the front. <laughs> but from the side, you never know. Let me know if you want a part two. all models a millionaire. Every year, Forbes lists the world's highest paid Uber models. In the last U.S. census, the average yearly income for models was $18,000. Fashion's main event, Fashion Week, is not going to add to that bottom line. A fashion show could pay you a few hundred dollars, if you're lucky. But most designers pay in clothing, not cash. One early year, after walking for almost every major fashion house, I was $40,000 in debt. So when and how do models make money? I'll explain in a minute. Are equally skilled or gifted, but the best have always had the skills to make a few of them. 